Working in close contact with machinery with fast moving and heavy parts poses a risk of hand injuries at the workplace. It is thus essential that we all do our part to put in place risk control measures to prevent workplace injuries. This video shares some good practices in the safe handling of machinery to minimize hand and finger injuries when operating the machines. Light curtains are one of the measures that companies can install to ensure workers' safety. Workers are reminded to stay clear of the machine when soldering is in process. The light curtains cuts off the machine movement once an obstruction has been detected. This prevents the workers' hands from being exposed to moving parts when the soldering action is ongoing. Machine guards are another way to prevent hand and finger injuries at the workplace. The machine guard blocks up the moving parts and prevents operators from placing their hands too close to the moving belt when the machine is in motion. When moving parts like gears and motors are exposed along the automation line conveyor, workers may accidentally get their hands trapped while working. By ensuring the guard is in place, contact with mechanical moving parts is restricted while machine is in operation. This reduces the risk of injury. With small metal links produced by the coil machine, the operator faces the risk of his fingers being caught between the shear while collecting the small links. A removable guard was installed over the shear to prevent the worker's hands from being caught in between the shears during collection. When using machines, like the wire processing machine, additional precaution must be taken to ensure that workers' hands will not get caught in between the moving pinch rollers. Installation of protective removable guarding with handles can reduce the risk of such occurrences. Our hands are one of our most important assets for our livelihoods. Let us remind ourselves to safeguard what is important. Take time to take care of your safety and health. <laughs>